Hi and welcome back to my channel. I'm Liz of Chicago Law Luxury Makeup. For today's vlog, we're gonna do a quick unboxing and then I'm gonna take you with me as I go to the lake. Timu reached out to me and asked if I'd be interested in joining their affiliate program and trying some of their products for free, letting you guys know what my thoughts are. I have never ordered anything from Timu. I have seen other people order it. My stepkids have ordered from there. I myself have never ordered it. So I went ahead and looked to see what they had to offer. They did have some storage organization type products. And you guys know I am trying to get organized. I am trying to organize my desk. I'm trying to organize my makeup. So I did pick up a few products in that area. So I'm going to unbox everything. Show you guys what I picked up. I honestly don't remember. I don't remember at all. So what happened was, again, they reached out. I went ahead, added stuff to my cart, and I never got any confirmation that it went through. And I've just been really, really busy, and I haven't ever followed up to see if the order went through. Did I need to do anything else? It went through, you guys. So I got this bag from Timu, and I opened the top part, but really, this is how it was packaged. So I don't know if that's normal. I don't know it was it was the oddest packaging I have ever seen but like I said I know I ordered storage and organization products so I'm gonna go ahead open all of that with you guys I got some stuff for my makeup but then I'm also we had our bathroom redone at the lake and we have this big closet huge wonderful closet but I need like bins to keep my stuff organized so assuming that I did get some of those I thought what we would do is I would drive to the lake, show you guys the lake, and we would organize together. I will definitely link everything that I picked up for you guys over at Timu. The shipping did not take long at all. I think I ordered this about a week ago, and it came in the mail yesterday. So I think it took about a week to get to me, um, and it, so it came fairly quick. This There is more stuff, but this first little piece or this first package that I pulled out, I did want to show you was bubble wrap. And it is these just clear plastic bins. And it came in like a pack of four. I actually have some very similar to this in my bathroom closet here. And these appear to be pretty much the exact same quality. I got mine on Amazon. These were definitely cheaper, definitely cheaper than the ones that I got on Amazon. Um, now the ones I got on Amazon were different shape but the actual material is the same so i got four of those and they do have like a little handle here so whatever came in this one is in a box and again inside the box is bubble wrap so this is more of the same just little plastic organizers but these are little for like drawers like a set of different shapes so i have two big rectangles I have two long rectangles, and then I have six of these little long skinny ones. I have six squares. That is really, really awesome. Lots of different organization bins. I'm really, really excited to get to the lake and start organizing. The next item also came in a box, and these are just little uh, plastic containers for the bathroom to put like cotton in or Q-tips. This one is probably for Q-tips or, you know, because it's got like a little space for it to roll down. And then another one that's just, just a little bit bigger. And they do have cute little lids. Now the lids aren't suctioned, so you wouldn't want to put anything in here that you need to keep airtight. But these are really, really cute. I can even stick these here on my... Uh, my little vanity where I film to keep some cotton and ketchups in. This thing I got was a pop-up travel hamper. I have one of these and we use it every time we travel and I saw that on there as like one of our because they had a whole section of just organizational and storage stuff and I did and I was like oh I really really like those I think they are great for travel they're very compact I kind of picked it up to see if I liked it and it is really really nice and again I think this was so so cheap um for something that you're not going to use every day I think it's perfect just for traveling you know throw it in your hotel room 
or wherever you are just to keep all your dirty clothes organized. So that is everything that I got from Timu. I'm really, really excited to go and organize my bathroom, organize my skincare and whatnot that I have at the lake. Some of these smaller little containers I'm going to probably keep here and try and organize my makeup. I'm going to see if they will fit in the Alex drawer and if they do I'm definitely going to be ordering more sets of the Alex drawers from Ikea and hopefully these will fit in there and I can throw like concealers, lip glosses, eyeliners, lip liners, stuff like that. Just checked and they do fit so I'm really really excited. Um, I will definitely link these for you guys and I'm probably going to go back and order some more so that I can start organizing these eyeshadows, these blushes. Guys, I need a lot of help organizing. So I will show you how they fit inside the Alex drawers and I will definitely link all of these products down below. So if you are also looking to organize, these products were very reasonably priced. So here is my Alex drawer. I have taken out all my eyeshadows because the drawer just got too heavy that I think it was breaking. So I did just take this long skinny one just to see how it would fit. And you can see that it does fit perfectly in there. And then same with this small one. So I can just add some eyeshadows like this one, the longer one. I just put some of the longer eyeshadows. Like I have this long... Bobby Brown, I've got these Natasha Denona's, and this is another Bobby Brown. But these are definitely going to work for organizing my Alex drawers. Here is our newly remodeled bathroom at the lake. I will try and also pop in some pictures of what it used to look like. I know many of you guys have asked about the remodel. But here is how it looks right now. The shower is brand new. Everything is actually brand new. We've got a new vanity or I don't know, sink, I guess vanity. I have this uh, storage shelf. I don't think I like it there. Um, I just don't know where else to put it. Um, so I think I might actually try and move something else in that place and I'll show you guys what that is. I have another shelf that I think might look better. I just don't know what to do with this one, but this has all of my hair care, my skin care. My husband does have a few things on here, but none of that's really organized. It's all kind of, you know, it's just a mess. So that definitely needs to be organized better. And then let me turn around and show you guys the closet. So here is the closet next to the shower. And this is what I bought the uh, organizers for, is for this shelf. So I can kind of just organize it. I don't like to just have clutter and that's what it is right now. So I bought those little uh, organizer bins from Timu and we're gonna use those today and try and organize this shelf. I think I will also try and organize that corner shelf too. So here's that other shelf that I have, and I think this would actually look better in the bathroom. So I think I'm probably going to try and swap it out. It's just trying to have everything, like all of my hair care, skin care, and all of that displayed might be a little bit harder. But we'll see. But that's what we're working with. I'm going to try and swap out those two shelves and organize my closet shelf today. I took everything off of my shelves and then I got out the plastic bins that I received from Timu and let me tell you guys I am so impressed with these bins. I really really am. I'm really impressed with the quality. It is the exact same quality of the bins that I purchased for Amazon and the ones that I purchased from Amazon were so much more expensive. Alright so I moved that other shelf here in the bathroom. I don't know if I like it. Um, I'm going to put all my stuff in there. We'll see how it looks. I don't know which is going to look better. Maybe none, none of them. I don't know. I don't know what to do. I need a shelf for my stuff, but yeah, that's what we got. So I'm going to go ahead, organize this, fill this in, and we'll see which one looks better. You guys can let me know. 
So I did have a few of those bins left over, so I used those to organize the inside of this little cabinet or this shelf. I do think that that really, really does help with the organization. And then on the top, I just put all of the skincare and hair care that I use pretty much every single day. So this is what it looks like right now. Let me know what you guys prefer. Do you think it looked better with that corner unit or do you like this shelf better? I'm really pretty much undecided right now. So there is the finished shelf. I don't know which is better. Neither one of them honestly look all that great. So I don't know what I'm gonna end up doing. I'll leave that one here for right now, but I have this other shelf. I don't really know what to put on it. Um, it's pretty empty right now, but I mean, that one looks fine, I guess. We'll see. I'll probably change my mind in a month. So here's just a quick drive around the lake. I didn't go all the way around, but you actually can drive all the way around the lake. There is a road that goes all the way around. But what I really liked about these clips is that you could see the difference in the lake in terms of some portions are completely frozen and then there's some that are not so frozen. So I really thought that that was interesting just depending on I'm missing, you know, where the sun hits or, you know, how deep the water is. There are definitely parts of the lake that are, are frozen and some that are not. But this is just a real quick, a real quick drive around the lake showing you guys how beautiful it is. So here is our little area of the lake. We have um, deeded access right here. So this is where in the summertime our pier is and we put our jet skis. And you can see that the water is actually um, a little bit frozen. It's starting to thaw, but it is still frozen. It is very, very peaceful out here today. And the sun is actually shining. So it is a beautiful, beautiful day. So I'm going to end the vlog here. I want to thank you all so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. I hope everyone is staying safe and healthy and I will see you in my next vlog. Bye.